Hello, companion animals, science students. This is a guard dog that I'd like to introduce you to. Hello. Hello. Now, guard dogs are a special kind of dog. They have a, they have a job. They have a purpose. And that purpose is not to be pets. And most of them can't be uh, petted. So this one is Sage. She has a little tag on that tells who she is. She's a great Pyrenees. She's pretty young. She's only a couple years old. But her job is just to guard the sheep. And she does that by creating a perimeter around the sheep, wherever they're at. It doesn't matter if they're on the mountain or in the valley or being moved. She creates a perimeter. And she also responds when there's threat of predation. Could be from coyotes or it could be from any unknown. Anyway, these dogs are really heroes, and I'd like, I'd like you to see them as such. Whenever you come across a guard dog uh, out guarding, you, you never know if they're guarding because they won't always be with sheep. They could be doing their perimeter check. Uh, but I want to make sure that you know and understand that it is not a dog that is lost and needs to be rescued. So make sure that you leave it alone and give it its space and respect the animals that it is guarding. Don't stress them or, or the guard dogs. They are really heroes and they're an awesome animal, but not a good companion animal. Sheep are inherently gregarious, which means that they like to be in a group. They feel safe, safety in numbers, so to speak. And that is one of the reasons that it's good to have something with that group at all times, something protecting that group of sheep at all times. Humans can't be there all of the time, and no matter how hard we trap or hunt or, or fence or take other measures to protect our livestock, sometimes we just need to call on nature to help us provide what, what we can't come up with on our own. And nature has provided us with the perfect solution and that is to use a predator against predator 